Welcome to the online operating instructions video for the CP Plus timed central heating panel for the Truma Combi Boiler. In the center, you can see the main control knob. Pressing this once for around three seconds will turn the control panel on, showing you the start or standby screen. The same procedure is used to switch the panel off. You will see in the center screen the current room temperature selected. The display will alternate between time and room temperature. The small curved arrow key next to the main control knob is the back key. When pressed, will take you back to the main menu. When on the main menu, you will see the following rows of symbols. Please remember, to select any icon, you need to scroll across and press the central control knob whilst the icon in question is highlighted. The first icon, which is the small vehicle and thermometer, is to set your heating option. Once selected, you simply rotate the control knob up or down until you reach your desired temperature, then press to confirm. After the heating is set, then click the back key to return to the main menu. Now scroll to the second symbol on the top row and click on it. This will change the temperature of your water. Again, like with the heating option, scroll up and down to find your ideal water temperature then press the control knob to approve your choice. You can choose either 40 or 60 degrees for your water, and there is also a boost function should you want to obtain the water quicker. Please note, with setting both the heating and hot water temperature, the symbols will flash. This just means it is working at your desired temperature. Your next symbol is to select your energy source. Here you can decide whether you want to run on gas, the bottle symbol, mix, which is a selection of gas and electric power, and electric, the lightning symbol. If you do want to run on electric, you must make sure there is a 230 volt power supply to the heater. Once set, then click back. Please note, when the weather is warmer and there isn't the need for the appliance to be in use, you can use the combi's fan on its own to circulate cool air around the vehicle compartment. The small fan symbol is what you would expect, the fan setting. First, you have the option of vent, meaning you can still have air circulating around your vehicle, even when the heater isn't turned on. You then have the option to set the fan speed from 1 to 10, 1 being the lowest and 10 being the fastest. If you do have your heater turned on, then you have the options of Eco or High, which offer low or high fan levels depending on your choice. The Eco setting may be of particular interest to those customers who need to minimise the draw on their 12-volt battery. And finally, there is the Boost function, making it possible to have rapid room heating if the difference between the selected room temperature and actual room temperature is 10 degrees or more. Please note, the more fan blades that are illuminated on the fan symbol show the fan speed is increasing. Next, the spanner symbol represents settings. This function will give you the display version of the heating system or panel, so you are able to identify the heater or panel itself with an engineer, and consequently any faults with it. In this setting, you can also change the brightness of the screen. And also the language. There is also a reset option, should you need to reset the panel completely. Please note, a common fault may be switching the panel on before the power is being connected. This will display an error code. However, don't worry, this can be easily resolved by connecting the electric hookup cable and pressing the reset option in settings. We hope this short video has proved helpful. We at Truma wish you great caravanning with your new CP Plus control panel and combi boiler.